Lower the set, Scotty. Okay, we're lowering the set, Josh. We're lowering the set. As they build the tank, they'll create lift on the set, and they can pick the set up with these hydraulic cables and raise it right up towards flush with the top of the tank. And then with all that water volume underneath it, they can then start to lower one end and just sink the whole thing. Oh my God. So that's the theory. Now, no one's ever <laughs> done this before. They keep telling me it's going to work. Is it like a but one shot deal? Or <laughs> no, it can't be because we have, have so much, we have so much coverage to do in here. So put it back to the to, uh, the, to the starting level. Reset, please. The efforts in wardrobe have been phenomenal, going out and purchasing actual vintage clothing and researching the time. Everyone combined puts forth an incredible amount of effort to make it perfect. How do I look? And you want it so badly to be right. You know, when Polly beads a dress, she wants to pick a bead that really existed in 1912. This is in my memory forever. Forever, this film would be with me forever. It's incredible. Every one, you know, you touch one and you say, oh, but look at this one. And then you go, oh, look at this one. It's, it's wonderful. I walked into the dining room for the first time, and of course all the tables are set, and you know everything's you know bright and gleaming the way they described it. The people who were there, and all of a sudden this flood of people in 1912 costume are crossing through the reception room and going into the dining room, and it's like the passengers are here for dinner. They've arrived. It was just unbelievable. All the crockery has been made absolutely accurate to the Titanic. The crystal is sensational. The cutlery is all stamped. It's awesome. I mean, it's, it's tremendous. And the caviar was scrummy. No caviar for me, thanks. Never did like it much. <laughs> it begins with Ruth going out of her way to trash Jack, and then quite honestly, and without any, any artifice or, or pre-thought, Jack winds up turning the table. You know, I, I wanted the first-class dinner to be very elegant and very correct for the times, the formality. She belongs to Thomas Andrews. But it's all for me. Just start from the outside and work your way in. And really, just as deadly as watching paint dry. I mean, this is not a world you want Rose to live the rest of her life within.